there's decadence like we have never known that has never been seen before in the annals of history going on in America every minute of every hour of every day a people brought out of Africa in the holds of ships never been done like that before a people sold by their own brothers into slavery like Joseph a people robbed and spoiled as it is written in the book of Daniel a people that had their names taken they used to wear the names of God but now their oppressive slave master gave them new names Shadrach Meshach and a bad Negro I mean a bad Negro <laughs> they used to speak their own language and they used to eat food according to the divine dictates of God but now in a strange land among a strange people they're eating the king's meat and he changed their tongue from their natural tongue that they may learn the tongue of the Chaldeans they're like gold and silver vessels brought out of the temple of Jerusalem but spoiled with wine and strong drink this is the condition of black people in America Religion has lost its power to transform human life. The houses of worship are houses of entertainment, but not houses of enlightenment that transform human life. Whether it is Islam, Judaism, or Christianity we have lost the power of Jesus Christ we've lost the power of Moses and Muhammad and Abraham how do you mean we have lost that power Jesus said the things that I do you shall also do he opened the eyes of the blind. Why are the people still blind if we're walking with the master? He made the dumb speak. Why can't the people speak if we're walking with the master? He healed the leper and the lame and the halt. But our people are like lame and halt people that have hands that don't build for ourselves. How can you put them on the wall to build when they don't know how to build? Somebody got to teach the hands to build again. You are like the master nailed to the cross. Your hands are nailed because they don't work to defend you. They don't work to build you. They don't work to deliver you. Your feet are nailed. So you can't walk the walk of free men. In a modern time like this, you walk like a slave. Pharaoh has already let you go. But it is you who have not let Pharaoh go. This is, this is why you are crippled. 
because you think you cannot walk without your former slave masters and if your former slave master don't help you you don't think there's any help for you even though you talk God you live in fear of your former slave masters and their children politicians selling us out paying lip service to the suffering of the people but hobnobbing with those who want to rob substance from the people that's why Jesus said it'd be easier for a camel to go through the eye of a needle than for a rich man to see the kingdom of heaven when we say our prayer when the disciples said to the master master teach us how to pray he said pray on this wise our father stop look at what that father did for Jesus you tied to him and look at your condition your father was Rockefeller why are there holes in your shoes <laughs> You look to me like you've been disinherited. <laughs> you look to me like a prodigal son who took his substance from his father and went off in a strange land among strange people trying to join himself on to be a citizen of a strange land go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. your problem is you are not now nor have you ever been a citizen of the United States of America you are a slave to white America That's the truth. That's the truth of it. I know this hurts. That's the truth of it. Fix it, God. Truth hurts. It bothers me to hear you crying. How you an American, but they treat you like a slave. It bothers me that you are willing to fight and die for something that is not willing to sacrifice nothing for you it bothers me to hear you say my country tears of thee sweet land of tyranny <laughs> of thee I sing land of white father's pride but land where my fathers died who will help the widow's son because sometimes we feel like a motherless child a long long way from home how can I sing the Lord's song in a strange land they that carried us away captive require of us a song Nobody can sing the songs of Zion like us. Sing, sing, sing for us, Negros.
Make us laugh. Come on. Negros. Come on, now. So I'll pay Cedric the entertainer. That's right. Come on. I'll pay the comedians big money to make me laugh while the masses of the people cry. You're in bad shape. Very bad shape. The richest slave that ever was. You got more money, but you're poorer than you've ever been in spirit. Stay red up, I never let up Everyone that I'm around already know what I'm about Build heaven on earth, gotta catch up Elijah Muhammad, Muhammad Ali, Sarah, come out, come back Now man, what about me?